Hey everybody, this is Kathy from Whole Home and Body Health. And today I wanna to show you some measurements that I'm getting off of a Roku TV. So when I'm doing home assessments, I see these more and more often. Um, Roku's, uh, Chrome TVs, um, Amazon Fire Sticks, all of these things. And they're giving off surprisingly high amounts of radio frequency, even when the TV is off. So I just wanted to show you that real quick. And I uh, have a TV here that has a Roku TV, so let's see what kind of measurements that we're getting. Okay, so I'm gonna use my Safe and Sound Pro meter today, and I'm gonna turn the sound on here. So you can hear that pulsing, um, and it's a little bit of static from the TV itself. So when I get to about, mm, two feet or so, I'm getting anywhere from, it's a little bit hard to see, anywhere from a couple hundred, right now I'm getting 30,000, 30,000 microwatts per square meter. Um, remember, we want that reading to be under 10 microwatts per square meter, and with the pulses here, now I'm getting 2,000. Um, the max I got was 66,000. So that is quite high. Um, and so I'm going to now turn the TV off and see what kind of reading we get. All right, I gotta be smarter than the remote, right? So I'm gonna turn the TV off and I'm gonna see if we're still getting the same kind of readings here. And I am, I, I just got a peak of 30,000 microwatts per square meter, 25,000, 21,000, 23, 13. If I move it back a little, four, 2,000, 5,000. So I'm definitely still getting a lot of, um, quite a bit of radio frequency off of the Roku TV just because it's plugged in. So that's what these things do they tend to continue to emit their radio frequency even though they're plugged in, which is just silly because there's no reason for that. So I'm gonna unplug the TV and see what happens here. Actually, I just unplugged the, the fire stick, uh, the, I'm sorry, the, the Roku and then the TV itself. So same distance from the TV. I'm getting about 100. It's, it's fluctuating a little because we've got some other stuff going on. You can hear a little bit of a cell tower in the background. Uh, but right now, 75, 300 um, microwatts per square meter. So significantly less with the TV unplugged. Um, so the takeaway here is if you've got one of these, a Roku TV, a Fire Stick, uh, you know, whatever, Apple TV, whatever device you have, when you're not using it, you need to unplug it so that you eliminate that radio frequency. It's silly to have this radio frequency pulsing 24 hours a day when you're not even watching the TV. So if you have to have one, I mean, I recommend everything is hardwired anyway. Um, and some of these you can, even if you hardwire, you still can't disable that radio frequency. So keep that in mind. But if you do have one, just unplug it when you're not using it so that you can eliminate all of that radio frequency when the TV is not being used. And that is my tip for you today. Uh, if this video is helpful for you, please subscribe to my channel below. That helps me to bring more of this information to more people. And uh, of course, if you've got any questions whatsoever, just let me know and I'll be happy to answer those. All right, thanks everybody, bye.